Alright, welcome back to Sonic Colors, where we're going to start the Aquarium Park. Which, um, probably has some of the best levels. Um, <clears throat> sometimes they're a little weird, a little difficult, but, uh, we start off here just kind of free-falling, which is always fun, I think. Free-fall wasn't used enough, I don't think, in the, uh, in this game. Now we're just in some tubes. Just a series of tubes. Yeah, I really love the looks of these levels. They're always really nice. And for the f one of the first times in a 3D Sonic game, um, water becomes a big part of it, and it, you do not die when you enter water. Which is always a good thing. I never really quite understood that. Ooh. Yeah, so, instead of like in Sonic Adventure or Sonic Adventure 2 or whatever, when you fall in water, it's an instant death. This is actually good water. So yeah, usually the first level of each zone is usually the best, and uh, this is probably the best level here too. Now I'm trying to push that box, but that doesn't work. This is the box you're supposed to hit. Sorry, my dog's barking for absolutely no reason. So if you charge it up, you can um, do that and hit some enemies. Pretty good. Now, if you don't want to go underwater, which I usually don't want to, because it's just kind of annoying and it takes longer than it should, you just boost. So Sonic kind of becomes Jesus and walk on water. You'll probably be seeing me boost over water very often. Because I'm really not a fan of, um... It's just, I don't know, it takes a lot longer than it should, I think. When you do go underwater. Oh, come on. I feel like that shouldn't have hit me. I was far enough away that it shouldn't have hit me. Hopefully I can find a place to use this, um... Wisp. Whoa. I didn't realize it was falling. Alright, let's just use boost. Whoa. Another really good wisp to use in these water levels is drill, which I have right now. It um it makes underwater actually a lot easier. I don't know why I'm moving this. I just feel like it. I don't know what makes him so different, because he didn't get hit by my, uh, boost. Oh boy. I almost just got hit there. Yeah, homing attack is a lot better than boosting in these sections. And it's a lot more fun, I think. Uh, don't go up there, just keep going here. I don't know why you can go up there. Again, quick step, always fun, in my opinion, anyway. Let's go back and get that. And boost here at the last second. Now this section is the only section in this level that you're actually required to go underwater, so... Yeah, that's because it has the goal ring. Let's get a B. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. That's the first B we've gotten in a long time. Alright, so now we're going to Act 2. Alright, Act 2. I don't quite remember this one. Oh, yes, I do. I totally remember this one. Again, gimmick here. There's actually two gimmicks here, which is the blue spaces and the, um... The things that rotate. Might as well just pick that up. 
because I'm sure I'm going to need it. Uh, yeah, just uh, not that special of a level, really. It's, yeah, it's just it's short, not that memorable, and uh, yeah. <clears throat> Although it's always fun to try and get Sonic to match up with the music just by having him crouch. I always used to do that in old school Sonic games, too. Sometimes it looks like it's working, other times it doesn't. So I picked up a uh, another Sonic game today for about 20 bucks. And that game would be uh, Sonic Unleashed. That's all I'm going to say on the matter. Because I might, in fact, do a walkthrough of it blind. And uh, we'll just leave it at that. Oh boy, I thought I was going to fall there. It's like, I'm at the end, don't let me fall. Alright, I can live with the sea. Alright, on to Act 3. <coughs> Excuse all my coughing. Whoa, that just sent me like right down. That wasn't cool. Let me progress up, please. I guess I'm just supposed to keep going down. And uh, pick up these air bubbles because they will, you know, you'll drown if you don't get them. And let me get up, let me get up, let me get up. Oh, thank you. That was really lucky of me. Did we already go through this area? Pretty sure we... Yeah, we went through this area. Why is this game reusing so many areas? Not too fond of that. Reuses bosses, too. I have no boost, so I can't skip over this water, unfortunately. The water is nice, but it's probably not the best looking graphically. Here's this area again. Why are we doing this again? That would be a nightmare if it, like, if one of the uh, red rings required you to get all of these rings. That would be so ridiculous and impossible. I need to pick up at least one of... There we go. I got one block at least of those rings. I don't know if I brought this up, but if you get 100 rings, you do not get a 1-up. And that's really off-putting for a Sonic game. Come on, B. Give me B. Give me B. You suck. I think I should have gotten to be there. Alright, Act 4. We're already more than halfway done with this. Oh, I remember this level. This is kind of troublesome. But it's a fun level. So yeah, just push this over here so you can actually get a step up and get up to this area here. Thankfully we have some boost there. I wish I'd saw him coming, but what can you do? Again, I'm just going to boost over water when I can. Boost. Oh, that was neat. That was really cool. 
come on, that totally should have hit them. And get the rest of these jokers. Slam. Is this another area we've been to already? It totally looks like we've been here. Actually, pretty much... Sorry, that was my dog. Pretty much every area in this game looks the same. Or, in this zone. Pretty sure that changes soon. We get to kind of a waterfall area, I think. Laser! That did almost nothing. Alright, here we go. This is always useful. Drill! Yeah, this, um, it gives you unlimited air as long as you're in this form. And, uh, it just helps you get around a lot faster, too. Alright, can I do anything here? I'm trying to break these blocks, but it's not letting me stand still. Nope. That wasn't a good idea. Yeah, that was pretty dumb, actually. Oh, boy. See, so yeah, I just go up. Now, this is another section where I didn't think I could progress, because I didn't know you could go to the right. Because it totally looks like you can't go any farther. But you, in fact, can. Alright. I love what Robotnik just said there. He's like, please do not arm wrestle the octopi. Sometimes it's, it's really entertaining listening to what he has to say. And I'm sure someone on YouTube put a video up of like, everything that he says, so check that out. I'm sure it's really entertaining. Thought I was gonna run into some enemies there. Yeah, these platforms move, that's their thing. What did I just hit? That was really weird. I really hope the end of the level is soon. I could laser up here, but I don't want to. Usually if it's set up in a way like that, you could probably get over there. That is my favorite Eggman line right there. This is so embarrassing. Right now, for some reason, I had a really big problem with this section. This snail is really obnoxious, actually. Just when he does that punch thing, you have to boost. Just keep boosting when he does that punch. And um, here, you just the, the sections that are lit up, go to the one that's not lit up. And you'll be fine. Like, now I have to go to the right. And I think that's the end of this section. No, there's another one. See, I got hit there because I didn't boost fast enough. Now I'm just going to try and get away from him. There's really no point in sticking around. And there we go. That guy does come back later, and it's a little more annoying, I think. But, uh, yeah, he's done for now. Yay! An A! I really didn't think I'd get an A on that. Where am I? There I am. Get the one up. Get the one up. There we go. Alright, well, I'll see you on the next video.